Is the picket brick wall worth it? Let's find out. What's going on everybody? It's your boy Potter with Grandmaster Bricks. Back from the Lego store and I've got myself a pick a brick wall order and I want to see if it's actually financially worth it to input into my brick store or if it's just more of a convenience factor. So it's going to be very store by store, cut by cut basis depending on how much you personally can fit. But here I went for the smallest pieces possible colors that I felt that were going to be good, pieces that I could possibly use and build in the future, and I just wanted to see roughly how many pieces I could fit. These would be great for architecture and buildings, so I just saw those and grabbed a good handful, and just basically did one scoop full of about eight or nine parts. Uh, the eyelids came, or the eyes came with the eyelids, the uh, couple different uh, like three different shapes, like a winky, a fully open, and then like a halfway open eyeball. So there's actually a little bit more subdivision, but in total I got nine specific parts and there on the receipt you can see I spent about $17, $17.31. I wasn't anticipating to get a pick a brick order or a pick a brick wall order, but I ended up getting it anyways when I went to the store and I didn't have another cup. If not I would have brought mine it would have been just a little bit cheaper. But here, now I'm in my Brick Owl store. That is where I put all of my inventory. I've been slowly transferring over to BrickLink. But here, and I, just so you know, when I priced it, I, I priced almost to the cheapest because I'm a new store. There you can see it was $50.90. So just over a thousand pieces for $17. And it equals out to $50 in the long term. You know, if, if, if I can get that back, if I can sell those parts within two years, that'll be really, really cool uh, just for a return on investment. But overall, it wasn't a complete dud. I know just depending on the parts, it will be different. I know one time I did a bunch of plates, some 4x4 plates, and I wasn't able to fit very much at all in the cup. So it's really cut by cup basis. But I thought it was cool that I took the time to actually count out and inventory a actual pick a brick wall cup. And I just thought it'd be a cool little insight for you guys if anybody was ever interested. And there we've got a little bit of a video of me putting it into my brick store. Looking all nice with all the colors and all the other drawers. So yeah, I think it's 100% worth it. And uh, let me know guys if y'all want to see more videos like this. Like, comment, subscribe, and never stop building.